Yo guys, what's going on? Zace is here today with another video. In today's video, I just want to talk about the Pilgrim Backpack, man, because this thing gets so much hate for honestly not a very good reason so do me a favor man make sure you guys are dropping a like on this video here today let's shoot for 50 likes and if you are new around here consider subscribing to the channel for tips tricks money guides and gameplays let's hop into this one man the pilgrim backpack sitting at a whopping container size of 35 a very good mid-range backpack when it comes to space the best backpack at the game being the couch bag being at 48 slots and the worst one, I think, being the sling at six slots. So it is definitely a good mid to upper tier backpack to run. But its biggest downside is its size and color. As you guys can see on our PMC here, it does not look great. It definitely does stick out like a sore thumb. And that's the main reason people don't like the Pilgrim backpack. Because it is a giant blue target on your back. And that is a very good reason, except for when it's not. Because every single raid that you load into shows you your weather conditions. The Pilgrim sticks out the worst in broad daylight. So if you have heavy fog, if you have heavy rain, even if you have a light rain, it's still going to make the sky gray. Or even better, if you're going into raid at night, the Pilgrim is a great bag to run. And it feels like a lot of players don't take advantage of the Pilgrims in their stash or they just sell them. When you have a 35 slot bag, getting 30K or 40K, whatever it is on quick sell, really isn't a great idea because you can have so much more potential using the bag rather than selling it. And even if you guys aren't comfortable running a Pilgrim, if you do have broad daylight at the current time you're trying to go in a raid, you can always go to a mechanism backpack, which you can buy from Ragman Loyalty Level 3 for 45,000 rubles, which is only three slots less than the Pilgrim. So it does look a lot better using the mechanism bag, especially in broad daylight. I'll show you what that looks like now. Don't get me wrong, 10 times cleaner, looks a lot better. And the mechanism bag is actually one of my favorite backpacks to run because it is actually so small on your back. But nonetheless, most of you guys won't have access to the mechanism bag. And that's why I wanted to talk about the Pilgrim. A lot of you guys who might not even be level 15 yet might actually have a Pilgrim backpack on you. And if you do progress a certain point in the hideout in the laboratory, you can actually make Pilgrim bags, which is pretty cool. But the Pilgrim bag gets way too much hate just because it's a giant blue target on your back because players are taking them into broad daylight raids. Be smart. Use this bag situationally. When the weather conditions are right, use a Pilgrim. If they're not good for Pilgrims, run a mechanism or run an even bigger bag. Or if you don't have enough rubles to afford those bags or you just don't have any for the Pilgrims because you can no longer buy them on the flea market, then just use whatever bag you want. But when you do have a Pilgrim in your possession, I highly recommend running it if the weather conditions do allow for it instead of it just sitting there or instead of you quick selling it. At 35 slots, you can't go wrong looting with it. It's a great bag to use. I just want to show it some love, man, because it is one of those bags that gets way too much hate, and it's still a great item to use in Escape from Tarkov. I don't really have anything else for you in today's video. I'm sorry if you were expecting more, but we have plenty of videos each and every day, and if you guys are a subscriber here, I'm sure you might have missed one or two, so go back a little bit, find something you haven't watched. There's a couple raids that should be up by this point when this video goes live. You got the Leg Meta raid. We should have the Ghost the glue heart out by now uh there's a couple other raids i uploaded earlier in the wipe i think we did like an hour challenge on how to make a million rubles really quickly so you know there's got to be something you haven't watched on the channel man if you want more from me but that's gonna do it for this video here today as always drop the like subscribe if you're new sponsor and equipment description below it's gonna be it for me thank you guys so much for stopping by i'm out